I'm hi everyone. I'm Mohammed Bilal, and you are watching Tensor Scared Me. So today in this lecture, I will tell you about how I dig deep about the risk factor view. But the thing is, risk factor view may is an advanced form of list view. So in this lecture, I will tell you about how to control how to control the risk factor view. Now it's quite easy. Just uh, I'm following the right hive. Let's create my new project here. The first thing is, the first thing here is you have to create the new project. And then just click next. Here, just click next. And here is my version. You can see here. Then click next. Okay, so here are the activities and it's like an empty activity okay to select the empty activity and then the thing is you just click on the next button and you see here the main activity just click finish button first thing you have to do when your project is loaded so the first thing you have to do is just go in gradle and import and import your Resector view and import your resector view. So, so you have to import this library. Okay, you have to import. Just write this thing here, and then just follow. Then click here. Since now, you will see the bar is loading here. Okay. The okay. When you done this thing, uh, when your project Gradle is successfully finished, you see here nothing just completely gradle is our syncing complete so now the thing is uh, we have to do some okay so now the thing is i have to i just add the recycler view here and this is the recycler view yes i have to and uh, in real this layout what should be its uh, what should be its uh, behavior what should be its behavior relative layout behavior so I just add that layout behavior should be like it should be like scrolling view behavior okay so now the next thing here so now the next thing here is I have to create the colors okay here is the colors and I just replace it with my copy colors so these are the colors here what should be the title what is the year the color of year whenever I call this color it should be like this grayish and whenever called title it should be like this black okay so now so now my the, mm, the new task the new task here is I am creating a new Java class and in this Java class I have to show the movies list so I am creating a movie um, class of movie and then press enter so now so now let's see so I created a new class here is movie and in this class I am writing a title genre and year of movie okay. these three things shows the what sort of movie it is this means that our list make a, a list a single row have these three things the title the genre and the year so here I am creating a set and get title, set and get genre, set and get year. So now let's see what just. So things are clear. So we have uh, one class of movie. So now let's go to our next step. So our next step is we have to create a list that how it should like. So for this we have to create uh, something like movie underscore list underscore row it means that how our row is showing so now we will see here you see here the recycler view uh, I'm just pasting the code here okay don't worry about the thing I will tell you about from where I get this code and this is purely perfectly works and thanks to Android Hive, thanks a lot man. 
it works perfectly okay so here is the relative layout you'll see here is the text view the text view and the three text views the first text view show about the title the second text view show about the genre and the third show about the year so you can see here what it should be like so these three things are here let me show you clearly you can see here that this is the year here this is the genre and this is the title okay things are not clear but when I so our next step is uh, to put the things in this list so for this we have an adapter adapter is working like a bridge between two things okay you are creating a list you call the list and then you set the list with full of arrays and adapter can set that uh, array in that list so now let's see how the adapter will work uh, for that so the class name should be movies adapter then press ok and now the thing is I am pasting the code here so in this code what I am doing is I just extend the recycler view adapter and then create a list a list of movie so you can just click here and then press control B you will see here you are calling this thing you are saying that a list of this class a list of these three things there must be present there when you press here control B you will see here in movie adapter you are calling this okay in movie adapter you are calling list and what you are doing here you are doing here is you are creating a class an inner class what it do it just write the text and get it from where uh, here it is getting from this thing genre the title and the year it's getting from this thing movie adapter getting this text and store it in these variables you see here the text view variables so now what the thing is the thing is I have to add the text in these variables so our list is created here you see how much simple the thing here is our list and here are the bind views these bind views just get the text where from where we are sending and then just stored it in those text it's like you see movie dot get title movie dot get genre movie dot get year it's just getting the things and set in these texts so let me add main activity so this is my main activity so what I will do is I have I am adding a static list you can add any sort of list you can add any sort of material you can call it from uh, you can pass the values yeah, that's th just the thing is you have to pass the values so you will see here is I just add the whole list I just removing this so this is my recycler view okay in my main activity so where is my recycler view in my main activity I just add the recycler view here so here is the recycler view in my main activity so the first thing is done so now the second thing here is I'm just following the recycler view okay so now the thing here is you see here the error list this is the list of movies we must have the list for the recycler view and we have an adapter so adapter has the data of these things so what I am doing here is so all the things are just set here and now my thing is just to send the data so I'm just sending Mad Max Fury Road movie name to class to movie class to its constructor so when you uh, when you click on the movie and you just press control B you will see where the things are going so the things are going here uh, road uh, sorry the Mad Max will just came here then it just is passed to this title and then this title is set here when you get that title 
here you will see the get get things are working you see here the things are quite uh, dim this shows that this thing is not working we don't need this thing because we are just sending the title as statically if you will send the title like dynamically then you can use the set title or get title so here we are using just get title just click on here and press control b you will see where you are getting this thing so you will see here you are getting this thing here so now our task is purely complete so the last thing here is just you will see a movie list dot add movie movie list is our movie and we are adding in this list our adapter okay so movie list dot add what movie list dot add the movie new array new thing and then at last just write m adapter dot notify data set change and the things will work perfectly so now we will run our code and see what just happened you are seeing here this is our uh, sector view activity and this is just a list you will see here mad max as the title and action adventure as its genre and 2015 is the year so this is how simple we will use uh, uh, sector view and then we will achieve this sort of thing it's quite flexible and it's more powerful than as compared to list view and i mentioned earlier that it is the advanced form of this view as we can change the things dynamically here but in this view we can't do this thing so i prefer you you can share this with others and if you like it then just click thumbs up and even subscriber for more videos i hope you like it